Riley. Yeah. It's called Hitler wearing that T-shirt, hasn't she? What did she say on it? Jeremy Corbyn is a racist endeavour. Well, that's because I mean it was. It's because you know when he when he was supposedly campaigning against apartheid, he was part of a group that was supportive of the Boers, and when he wanted to meet Nelson Mandela, Nelson Mandela was like, "No, I think you're counterproductive to what we're trying to achieve." But you know, yeah. this, this is the lovely Jeremy Corbyn who supports Every, yeah, everybody. Yeah, yeah. I, I, again, it's 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 propaganda and it's ignorance. Everyone holds that picture up as like it, they're doing it a lot, aren't they? With Boris, like they, you know, it's like they they try and make out that this is the same day. Like Boris is sat in his dinner suit on the steps, you know, presumably about to burn a fifty pound note in front of a homeless person, and then they show uh, Corbyn demonstrating against the apartheid. But they always leave out the part that he's he's hanging about with a load of lunatic communists, Trotskyists. Yeah, and like, the IRA. Like, proper hard. And giving the Muslim Brotherhood salutes and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, like, literally, that picture was taken. He was one of the lunatics. You know, I he, the, the Antifa guy that just beat the shit out of an old man with a bike clock, he might have had a love his hope, you know, love love <laughs> his blind poster just before that. Doesn't make him a good person. And, and like you said, Mandela himself was like, no, you guys are the freaks. Yeah. I'm not hanging about with you. I mean, he did. He met with the people that supported him and he thanked them. But them lot, Corbyn's like, he was like, no, 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 crazy fucking communists. Yeah. We put tires around people's heads <laughs> and set it on fire. But even that freak's too much for me. No, no. But yeah, well, yeah good Rachel on Rachel Riley gets a load of shit anyway, don't she? Because, I mean, she, yeah, to be fair, she's... She gave me a bit of a not a big talking to that she made a post about the online forum bill, which I actually had a very brief exchange with Lucy Powell, the MP who put that together. And you know, the, yes, the encouragement to have my say, so I broke the whole bill down and showed why it wouldn't work based on years of doing this, so and just blanked me. So when I said to Rachel Riley, Look, based on all my experience and everything, I'm telling you this won't work, it was like, Yes, well. Some very experienced people have put this together. As we say, you stupid little boy, go away. Which I like her just for treating me like that. Um, but yeah, people are really, really offended. They're all calling for it to be sacked from fucking a fucking game show. Mm, I know, she I does, know. She does sums on a game show. I mean, cool, yeah. guys. It, well, it, here's, here's the thing, man. She's entitled to her opinion and she's entitled to her perspective. Mm -hmm. why, why would you fire her from the game show? I mean, the, the, the Labour Party are tangibly racist. I'm sick of them going on about anti-Semitism. No, they're just racist, full stop. The thing is, you can't, you can't go against Corbyn. You're not allowed. Look at that prick from Momentum. You know, the guy that lives in a fucking mansion and wants to give away everybody else's money. I mean, they've all come out recently. The guy who you know, started... Um, Extinction Rebellion, one of the founders of it, came out recently and by, by calling the Holocaust, oh, just more of that human shit, sort of thing humans do. Ugh, it's nothing. It's like, dude, that's, that's, there's hot takes and there's really stupid hot takes, but we are living in a time, and I don't care what anyone says, all this bullshit here about, you know, the people you can't criticise and all that. We're living at a time where it's the one of the few minorities you can still have a bit of a poker. Mm. You know, just because of their cultural beliefs or if you believe in it they're racist belief i don't know but yeah uh, you know whether you think they're a race or just a, a cultural uh phenomenon based around the religion whatever it is they're, they're still a minority and it's the only minority you can tell point blank that you're imagining the bigotry against you <coughs> yeah. the only one the, the only one you can say to point blank and possibly get away with it Unless you're an MP. But then again, MPs should know better. If you go and have a pop at any minority when you're an MP, most MPs, you're going to be hanged for it. Unless you're Boris Johnson. Yeah, yeah. Did you see... Um, 